Good morning, family. Trying to be a little extra this morning. Hey, how you doing, son? Hey, good morning, good morning, good morning, baby. Check this out, y'all. We got the uh, the bacon. We got that waffle. Croissant. Egg. Time to make me some coffee, though. Let's see here. And just early morning grind. Um, shout out to the lady for making breakfast. We've been uh, just eating at the house, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Before all this, man, we used to always eat out every single day, which um, it's nothing wrong with it. I mean, you know, fast and easy, but now we just tend to just eat at home. Whatever's home, so just one slice of bread, amen, you feel me? And just to have the kids get used to just eating at home because I ain't gonna lie, they're spoiled. <laughs> they're spoiled, so when we don't eat out, they be like, oh, I want this, I want that, I want this, I want that. But w when I was growing up, you know, we just ate whatever is at the house. Home cooked meal is the best way to go, y'all. Making uh, brewed coffee, Starbucks. Part like about five dollar a cup, four, four to five dollars a cup, depending on what type of coffee you're getting. You know what I mean? Homemade coffee too, man. That saves a lot of money. Tea spoon of blue agave, not too heavy, cause uh, I like my coffee bitter. I don't like it sweet. You know what I mean? French vanilla. One creamer. Let's see? And I'll save this for the next coffee. I thought it's away. Leave it, Thank you, son. Yeah. Cheers, y'all. Hopefully everyone out there has a amazing day. Coffee's on fire. Coffee is on fire. Oh my goodness. Oh, check this out, y'all. Ham, egg, cheese, croissant is still nice and fluffy. Well, welcome back to my uh, my logs, y'all. It's another day. I have some breakfast, and like I said earlier, just gonna uh, do the exterior work. I do it every other week. Gotta look clean, you know. Outside and the inside gotta look perfect. You know what I mean? Not perfect, but okay. You know what I mean? Presentable. Cheers, y'all. Hey, Queen, what you having for breakfast? Egg sandwich. Oh, just egg sandwich? You didn't have no ham in it? No? You just like the... Uh... I'm just gonna add bacon. You gonna add bacon? Oh, yes, sir. Hey, boss lady. Good morning, boss lady. Good morning, boss lady. Hey, good morning. Yeah, explain to them what you're having for breakfast, son. What are you having? Okay. You have hot pocket and what else? Apple juice. 
That's not apple juice. That's uh, guava juice. Yeah, guava juice. And then what else? What else? What is this? Yes, uh, so that's what my son is having. Some uh, hot pocket, uh, waffle, waffle, egg, egg, and guava juice. Check out the bacon, y'all. Check it out. Yeah, I'm gonna check out this ham and add the uh, bacon. The uh, egg, bacon. Cheers, y'all. Kids all of a sudden be camera shy now, um, but I love, I like to include them in the videos too, because it makes a big difference, you know, when you look back on the videos, man, be like, dang, they've grown so much. And my lady too as well, uh, she don't like being on camera, but you know, it's something to get used to, because uh, I, I ain't gonna lie, man, I be pulling out the camera randomly throughout the day. I like to include my family in, in my videos, something to get used to for my lady, because she usually don't like being on camera. You know, I gotta get her in, you know, she's part of my blog. Something to always look back on, you know, and that's the whole reason behind me quitting content and blogs, um, just to entertain y'all, and not only that, just a, a record for me and my family to look on, you know what I mean? Um, and this is the era we live in too, you feel me? I would never thought of creating content. Just to keep it all the way honey. this is just a Samoan family on YouTube that inspired me to just create content, you know? He uh, creating content of his family. What made me uh, <clears throat> hop on a YouTube thing and create content. Yeah, if he does see this, man, I appreciate you and your family for inspiring your boy the island boy to create content because uh i can uh relate to the videos and you know it's all about family and having a good time that's the most important thing family and good times How you doing, man? Good, good, all right. Let's see what up. Bro, it's too old. And then another day, another vlog, man. Nah, I'm just vlogging today, man. I just head out to the, uh, you know, the music store. Yeah, I'm with my bro, H2O, man. Hey, when was the first time that you put out a record, man? Started when I was back in high school. Um, I was, uh, I was a junior at the time. I uh, do songs and learn from it and just loving it. My project is how to transfer songs to to MySpace and other stuff like that. Yeah. Oh yeah, we were working with um, GarageBand, a program GarageBand, and with Reasons for those to get beats and stuff and put them together and create songs out of that. I like this, I like doing song in this class because it's my thing. love doing beats over here and that's all. Take this class. I guarantee you that. Record videos, do animations, build websites, and many, many other things. I'm working on this video. I think it's the freedom, the things we can choose to do. Because there's a lot of people in this class and everybody got their own project. And if they actually want to get better in their computer skills, video skills, or even, you know, like I'm doing right now, I'm not. This individual that I met up and he took me out there to um, his uh, studio. 
Is it East Palata, right? Um, yeah. Is it, it the was, uh, Fijian uh, dude, or was it? No, it was. Uh, it was. Uh, it was a studio, like a real studio, at uh, at uh, San Jose. Oh, it was in San Jose. Yeah. I know. I, I remember when you came out to, uh, with that uh, record. There was two records you came out with from way back, and you just kind of like stopped doing music. But it was the first record. I think the first record was Mama. Uh, uh, but the second record was like a love song. Uh, when was the first time you uh, picked up a guitar, though, man? I remember growing up. Ooh, damn. And that's a nice car, too. Damn, you would have hit that car. Then that was a close one. Hold on, where's that, um, that uh, music shop at? Did I pass it? But I, I remember, bro, like, uh, uh, two old started with the drums. I remember back then, used to start banging on shit, and moms and pops used to get mad, like, <laughs> and, uh, honestly, I thought he was gonna become the drummer. Uh, what, what we used to do back in the days, bro, like, let him know, let him know. I would just get, like, pots and pans, and I would set them in front of me, and I would just go at it. I'd just get, like, spoons and a fork, I would just drum just would you say like drums like was your first like you yeah. know love for it's like yeah, you know when it comes down to instruments yes uh, drum was my first passion for real yeah, yeah like, that's I, I, crazy I really like playing drums I know I remember it too that's the crazy part yeah. but eventually uh it didn't go that it way it didn't go that way I was beginning at church when so instead I uh, picked up the guitar I stick with yeah. Might have been like around 11, 12. To pick up, pick up the guitar yeah. or the drums? Because I, I remember you was drumming at a young age. The drums, I was young. Um, I might have been 9, 10. I didn't, and I didn't play the drums eventually, but um, instead I picked up the guitar. Maybe I was like 14, 15 at the time. Picked up the guitar and then, and then I became a guitarist. Bro, too old son is a drummer, just like his uncle. But it's a blessing, man, just to see him have passion for music. My parents' background, they did not play any type of instruments. It's the first generation of making music, you know what I mean? Playing the instruments. Over here at the guitar shop.
Oh, Lord, oh.